Surf City, El Salvador. This seaside village is not only a surfer's paradise, those who follow cryptocurrencies closely know it better as Bitcoin Beach. Bitcoin Beach. Bitcoin Beach. Bitcoin Beach. Bitcoin Beach. It's Bitcoin. It's Bitcoin. It's Bitcoin, 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 right? From a tourism perspective, we know how to tell our tourists apart. We know who's a surfer and we know who's a Bitcoiner. Salvadoran authorities say Bitcoin has been a net positive for tourism since it was made a national currency in 2021. What is Bitcoin City going to And Salvadoran for? President Nayib Bukele, who was recently elected to a second term, is betting big on using Bitcoin as a tool for development. Part of that plan includes a new law that grants expedited citizenship to foreigners who choose to invest in the country using Bitcoin. There's a remarkable transition going on here, economically, you know, uh, just uh, in terms of sentiment. Soy Salvador. John is from Canada, and as of January of this year, he's also a bona fide citizen of El Salvador. I, I decided that um, I really want to be part of what's happening here and support. I'm all in. Um, gusta la playa, el sol y Bitcoin. There's clearly enthusiasm for Bitcoin here, but the love is not universal. Critics say there's a lack of transparency altogether when it comes to matters of Bitcoin and the government. It's become a black hole for public finance. Everything that has been used for Bitcoin with taxpayer money becomes lost without a trace. Some argue that big promises related to Bitcoin have yet to materialize, like construction of a mega project dubbed Bitcoin City, powered by geothermal energy from an active volcano. More than two years after the adoption of the currency, the use of Bitcoin among a majority of Salvadorans is low. Most still prefer to use paper money. There's also the warnings from the International Monetary Fund over the volatility of cryptocurrencies and the risk of adopting one as legal tender. Uno, vamos! But despite all this, El Salvador's Bitcoin experiment continues to attract attention. Whether or not El Salvador's Bitcoin gamble is paying off for the nation's economy is debatable. One thing that is certain is that Bitcoin Beach has become a haven for cryptocurrency enthusiasts from around the world. Though El Salvador is not the only country which offers a citizenship by investment scheme, it may be the only one that currently accepts Bitcoin for surf lessons. Manuel Rapalo Al Jazeera, El Salvador's Surf City. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.